We're in Tempe where ASU Beach Volleyball is having their most successful season to date and a lot of that credit comes from Ollie O'Caro and Ashley Wentz, the top pair for ASU Beach Volleyball and today we're going to be seeing them. We're going to put them to the test against me and my buddy Griffin. It's going to be a little tough but uh, we'll see if we could if we could handle them. Cat. Here. Cross your I, angle. I, I, oh. <coughs> oh, hell yeah. Straight up. Fine. Oh, oh. Nice. Nice <laughs> You guys came into the season, won 12 straight matches, was named Pac-12 Pair of the Week for the first time in this program's history. So how does it, how do you guys keep that consistency? Yeah, and definitely I think both being fifth years, our experience just handling the pressure of yeah. performing well. Like, we both played on teams that have done really well in seasons, and so, <laughs> It's something that you get used to over the years, that kind of pressure. No. Nice! Dang it! So you two are both taller players and you're used to seeing a tall person, short person. So how do you guys compensate for that? Since, Ash, since we are both really tall, we cover a lot of ground. Ashley's really tall with the block, so like, Teams need to really shoot high above her, you know, right. which gives me so much more time to make that defensive play around it and get to that ball, you know. So that's how we're able to like use our, work, our heights yeah. to our advantage, yeah. You. Mine. Yeah. Straight up. Oh no. Oh Here, no. fly mine. <laughs> you gotta get that one. <laughs> so you did two years at University of San Francisco uh -huh. and you did four years at Ohio State. So what kind of brought you to ASU? to play beach volleyball? Because this is your first year ever playing beach yeah. volleyball. So how's this experience been? It's been amazing. Uh, so I used four years of eligibility with indoor volleyball, and that's all you get with one sport, but you technically get five years of eligibility total. So I really use beach volleyball to be able to come to a school and be able to get my master's degree. Oh, okay. That's kind of the end goal of that. And ASU just really fit everything that I wanted, beautiful weather, programs that I was interested in scholarships that were available yeah. so yeah that's kind of how I ended up here but I spent the four years at Ohio State and then I had to leave right. so yeah here I am let's try this again oh you're off oh in and out nice good job so when you guys come here because you guys go into the same van when you guys come here correct uh -huh. so what kind of music do you guys listen to on the way over you mean when we travel places yeah, sure, yeah. Um, well, our van is very controversial. <laughs> we have a lot of different music There's tastes like in different, our van. So many different tastes. I like to listen to hip hop and rap. That gets me going before a game, you know? Right. But we have some players, like one of our teammates, she doesn't like that, or like, she likes kind of more of a nice, like, is it EDM that she likes? Or it's yeah, just or kind like of a more pop, music. you know, kind of like okay. pop or EDM, yeah. kind of like that. So it's like, we're trying to figure out like where to find the balance in between, you know? Oh, come on, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, come on, out, oh, out, oh, out, out, out. Oh, in. Dang it. Nice. Nice shot. Kate Baldwin and Sam Plaster, they just became the winningest duo. So what does that mean for you guys to see that success from the younger players? What I like the most when I watch them play is their no die attitude. They play with so much fire. Uh -huh. Like, it's just so nice to see because, like, just looking, like you said, like, how is the future going to look for this program? Like, we feel that it's going to be secured. Like, you know, with players like that, you know, they don't, they're so relentless and they go so hard and we know, like, it's, like, secured, you know, just, like, moving on and the kind of, like, um, leadership and players that they will, that they are and that they will bring to the team as the team yeah. uh, keeps progressing throughout the years, you know, and because they're young as well. So it's really nice to see. From Ashley Wentz and Ollie O'Carroll, I'm Reed Harmon, and this is Cronkite Sports.